Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So in this one, in this video today, I'm going to be showing you a Shopify store that does $3 million in sales every single year. We'll be having a good look at their setup. So I'll be showing you what their best selling product is. I'll show you the ad creatives they use to sell that product. And of course, we'll take a good look at their Shopify store too. Um, and just in general, have a good look through what their current setup is and have a look at the things that they're doing that we can take and integrate and implement into our own businesses. One of my very favorite product research strategies is flipper.com. This is where I found these guys this is where you can find the Shopify stores that are currently very very successful and they are the guys obviously you want to be learning from so every now and again I have a flick through I actually have email alerts set up as well so when stores like this come up for sale on the platform I can have a good look through what they're doing and see if there's the odd golden nugget that I can actually take and implement into my own brands so let's jump in then and take a look and I'll bring out my pen for this one just to highlight some of the key information this brand is called Bezily. it is 1.2 years old it's a US based Apple watch accessories brand they sell a variety of different bracelets that attach onto an Apple watch they do 3 million US dollars in yearly revenue with a 13% profit margin 13% perhaps a little bit on the low side um, drop shipping it's no secret that profit margins are not great because obviously when you're buying one item at a time it's gonna be a lot more expensive versus buying a thousand units at a time so typical drop shipping profit margins are anywhere between sort of 10 and 20 percent what's really good about these guys is they have a 12 percent customer retention rate that basically means for every 100 customers they get another 10 of those are gonna come back and then buy something else as well. So that's real kind of like true testament to how quality their products are. Monthly profit is 30,000 US dollars. And like I said at the beginning, this is just 1.2 years old. So imagine having a business simply 14 months away from now, making you that sort of money. That truly is one of the awesome, awesome things about dropshipping is when you find that golden recipe of store, product, ad creative and supplier, things can change very, very quickly for you. So don't give up because you are always just one product away from changing your life very significantly. Without being too preachy and too cheesy, it is 100% true. Let's have a look at the sales volume then from the past 12 months. As we can see, it's still a very active business, consistently turning over in excess, even in the worst of months, over $100,000 with their smallest profit month of $15,000 with a profit last month of just under 30,000 US dollars. So this is still very much an active business and you are going to see verified proven winners that are working right now. This is not a past pump and dump store that they're trying to get rid of. This is still very much a very active and very successful business and there's a lot to be learned from them. So in summary, $2.7 million from the past 12 months, an annual profit of 373,000, which translates into a profit margin of 14%. They're currently spending $15,000 a month on shipping, which is just crazy. $80,000 on marketing each month and platform fees of three 50s. That will be, of course, their premium Shopify subscription. Let's have a look then at their setup. So Bezily.com is a direct-to-consumer brand specializing in Apple Watch straps. It is an Apple Watch strap that is their best-selling product. I'll show you the exact variation in a second. The operations then, they maintain excellent relationships with 3PL agents, i.e. not AliExpress, um, and manufacturers in China. So their products are being shipped from China direct to consumer, i.e. they are drop shipping. The business operates with a highly effective direct response advertising strategy. Basically what that means is that if they put 10 grand into an ad, they expect to see a direct return for that $10,000. They're not playing the long game. They are planning on pouring X into the machine and getting a profit in return. With a primary focus on meta platforms, i.e. Facebook and Instagram, and we will be, of course, jumping into the Facebook ads library and having a look at the exact ad creatives and formats they've used to generate over $3 million in sales. Their primary markets then are actually global, including the USA, Canada, UK, Europe, Australia, and the Middle East. So I think it's pretty safe to say, no matter where you're watching this video from, there's an opportunity for you to sell a similar product in your country and take a piece of this pie. This is such a massive, massive market. Let's jump onto their Shopify store then. The first thing that hits you is the 
originality and professionalism of the brand. It doesn't look like your very stereotypical dropshipping store in the fact that they have straight away some packaging here, which we can see has their logo on. And they also have this certificate of authenticity to really kind of establish the brand and kind of put it on a pedestal versus anybody else and kind of position themselves as the market leaders, the industry leaders for selling these Apple Watch straps. Let's come down through the Shopify store then everything is kind of clean and on brand with the white backgrounds. This is indeed their best selling product is the titanium band. Um, if we come into our Koala inspector and we go to products and we go to best sellers, we can see it's the titanium band for Apple Watch, which is this one just here. This is their best selling products, which they're currently selling for £59. So it's in that perfect sweet spot to be considered kind of like an impulse buy purchase, potentially towards the top range, um, but definitely within that range. Let's jump onto the product page then for the best selling product. Everything is quite clean and quite simplistic. There's nothing like too complex or overly professional to the point where it would cost a lot of money to replicate. Let's move down through the product description. This is where they start to now set themselves apart from any competition. Most people would not go to the lengths of getting these custom animations with the branding on to put on their website and set themselves apart from any competition. This is what all successful Shopify stores do. If there is one thing you take away from this video and it's not the product and it's not the strategy or the ad creatives, it is the way in which they've invested into their business to set themselves apart from anybody else. If you are considering buying a titanium strap for your watch, you come across these guys who have the custom animations, the product comes in a custom box, they have this 3D interactive um, infographic, that's not the right word, is they have this basically on their website, and then you have some guys that just have bland stock imagery that you've seen on two or three other sites um, that they've just imported from AliExpress. 100% you're gonna go for these guys, even if they are a little bit more expensive, because you would have instantly or naturally have more trust because they have a more professional website. As we come down then, very straightforward image with text segments, which you can integrate into any theme. They have this scrolling banner, which is really good. Lots and lots of social proof, 30,000 plus happy customers. And what they've actually done, I've talked about doing this before on Shopify stores in the past, is rather than just have looks reviews, that typical image reviews app that everybody has on their site now, why not import or screenshot comments from happy customers from Facebook so people can see these are real people. These are reviews that cannot be faked because they're from real profiles on Facebook that anybody can go and look up and see what they've commented. So they do a really, really good job as well as having the typical image reviews app installed. Just a word on this packaging because there'll be some people watching this video that think, I don't have the budget, I don't have this or that. Um, I don't have the financial investment behind me or backing behind me to invest in hundreds if not thousands of branded boxes to sell my product in. The, my go-to suppliers in China have the machinery to print on demand packaging. So basically make packaging to demand one off at a time, meaning you don't have to commit to 100 units. There's no minimum order quantity basically. So you can still drop ship a product like this in branded packaging without the need of any financial commitment to an X amount of stock or X amount of units. And I'm gonna do a video specifically on my supplier in the coming weeks. So if you do wanna see that, make sure you subscribe to the channel. So up to this point, we've seen the numbers, we've seen the product that's generating the numbers. Let's have a look at the ad creatives. So if you jump into the Facebook ads library, first things foremost, 250 different results. These guys have experimented with a wide variation of different ad creatives. Um, and let's just take a quick look at a couple of them to see what they look like. So let's open up this one. So you might have heard me speak about in videos in the past about the hook for your ad creative. It's the first few seconds that get somebody interested. This would not get the same eyeballs or the same attention if it started with a video on somebody's wrist. The fact that it's on somebody's ankle, somebody's leg is out of the ordinary. It's peculiar. It's almost weird enough for somebody to comment something stupid or have to or make a comment on it, which is good because it's all interaction and it's all engagement, which is what Facebook likes to see because they are a social media platform. Now, the other thing to take away is look how simple these ad creatives are. These ad creatives could be created by me, they could be created by you, they could be created by anybody with a smartphone and 
20 or 30 dollars to buy one of these so they can literally do the filming on their very own wrist and post and that is all it has taken these guys to generate millions of dollars in sales let's have a look at this one and see if it's any different so again the same opening few seconds so they probably split tested that over and over again and found that that's the best hook it goes straight into this really nice kind of like ASMR showing the brand showing how professional and real it is and again it's all original content that cannot be stolen from anybody else because it has their logos on but again same style they have a mobile phone or they have something on their head or they just have a very simple and basic camera setup with their wrist in shot there's no faces there's nobody talking about it dead easy and simple to create for yourself and so with that being said guys that is bezley.com the business i wanted to show you before you go if you stay this long i have a very secret message just for you so if you've watched my video all the way through you're probably quite serious about drop shipping and you want to start your very own profitable drop shipping store because you are serious and because you watched this video all the way through i want to invite you to jump on a call with me and let's have a discussion about working together on a one-to-one -one basis the reason i put this video the reason i put this message sorry at the end of the video is because i don't want every man and his dog booking up my diary i only want to work with those people who are serious about drop shipping and building a legitimate business that's going to change their lives for the better a business similar to bezley.com if that is you what you need to do is below this video you will see a link that says this it says mentorship link if you click that it's going to take you to this page here it's a series of five or six questions it takes a couple of minutes to fill out it's basically an opportunity for me to get to know where you're at now and where you want to be in a couple of months time with my help and if it's something i can help you with and it's a realistic goal then it will take you through to my diary where you'll be able to select a time and date in which me and you can jump on a call and have a friendly chat and discussion about whether we'll be a good fit for each other so if that sounds good to you head to that link now book in that call and I look forward to meeting you. Thanks.